Hey everyone, enjoy the show. How are you doing today? So with uh, great pleasure, I bring you a beautiful horse racing, odds changing wheel. In my career, I probably had 10 wheels or so. Most of them were dice wheels or dice wheels, which I would turn into money wheels, which were really very nice. I bought this wheel. This is a 36 inch wheel. It is unmarked, but it's most likely an H.C. Evans or a Mason wheel, okay? But it's of the same quality. It's, it's, it's a high, high, high quality wheel. The, really, the markings make no difference. It's 36 inches wide. When I bought this wheel, everything was brown. The pole was brown, the interior, all of this was brown, which was very inappropriate for it. So we did a complete repaint job on it with a black and red color scheme. Now all the plating on this is all original. All we had to do was shine it up, which made it a lot nicer for me not to have to take this glass out and send that for plate. That's all original plating. This is reverse glass glue chip mirrored. And I'm really quite certain that this was all hand painted here, okay? And first they would get the, the, the glue chip glass mirrored out and then they would have artists sit down and paint those horses one by one. This is one of the prettiest wheels they ever made was the full reverse glass wheel. This one is in great condition. The pole, you'll see it in the still shots. And we married it with a nice little stand here. Currently it is not screwed down. However, there are screw holes here so when you receive it, you should probably put some little screws in there. It runs right, it is right, as well as I liked, I added just the nicest little light here to show off the winner. I mean, how pretty is that, right? So what we're gonna do, we'll run the wheel for you. Everything is correct, everything runs good. So the way this works is horse number six pays nine to one. I'm gonna show you what the layout would look like. The layout simply would look like one through 10, however you wanna lay it out. You wanna lay it all out straight or block it or whatever. It's just one through 10. You place your bet on one through 10. And then if you would've placed your bet on six and you'd have had a dollar on it, you would've got nine for one. The thing runs good. Once again, you're gonna see the back of it, which looks fantastic in the stills. This is a great little wheel. It's got the correct sound. The odds changer works correctly, works very good. So here we go, five pays two to one. And as you see here, it says pays two, one, pays two to one, okay? So these were very popular. Horse racing was very popular at the turn of the century. I'm putting this in the 1920s. It could well have went into the mid thirties. I'm not sure, but it is a early vintage wheel. I'm gonna play it one more time for you. All uh, The glass is near mint. There's no cracks or breaks. Very difficult to find these wheels with good, correct, unbroken glass in them, and this is one of them. Just a beautiful little wheel. We married it up with a great little stand. It all comes as a package. Tell me that ain't cool. Number one pays five to one. Wonderful. Anyway, somebody's gonna get this. They're gonna love this. This is a fabulous piece. As far as just putting it in the corner, this thing shines, shines, shines. Uh, I'd love to keep it. Uh, these are one of my favorite wheels, and it is 36 incher so it's really nice and small, but it has everything that a big wheel has. Anyway, good to go, and thank you for watching our videos, and remember, we do restorations. These are antiques. These are mantiques. Antique, mantique. These guys sell mantiques. This is their store. We're picking, we're bringing stuff every day, in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from 9 to 5 or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.